Hi, it's Lee up here at the range again with the Glock 43X. At this point I have 290 rounds through it. So based on my 290 rounds, I have made some modifications to it. Uh, the first thing was to put handle tight grips on it to give it a little more grip texture because the grip texture on the stock Glock 43X is almost non-existent and it slips around in my hand and my support thumb slides off of the frame while shooting. Uh, the other is I put a light on it Never had a light, but I figured I'd try one out. I'll give it a little more weight. But what we're going to do to try out the modifications that I've done is I'll take the light off, and then with the handle tight grips, I'll shoot three, five, and seven yards, and then compare my group size to the post grips, and then I'll put the light back on, and then shoot three, five, and seven yards with the light, and see if that makes any difference. Okay, so this is three yards with the handle tight grips, and Winchester 115 white box. grip a little better especially on uh, my support hand my thumb is still coming off so here we are seven yards and this is with the handle tight grips Okay, so we put the light back on. We're at three yards with the 115 Winchester white box. Wow, that stunk. Okay, so we're five yards now. Okay, so we're back at seven yards with the handle tight grips and light. See if we can tighten this group up a little bit. Okay, so with just the uh, the grips, we've got about an inch and five eighths group, inch and a half from center to center, and then with the light, you add in this one here. It's about a three inch group, center to center. If you take that out, it's about two and three quarters, and that's a three yards. At five yards, I think I pulled that one down. I'm not sure. I think I did. It's two and a half. Otherwise, it's about an inch and a half. And that's with just the grips. And then with the light, it's about an inch and three quarters. And then at seven yards. Opened up to about three and a half, and that's all me. Uh, just getting used to the Glock. I think a lot of it for me is the trigger. So, the one thing I did notice when I shot with the light is I was resting my finger on the light, and I think that's why I dropped these shots low. 
Uh, on the five yards, I switched back to uh, having my finger on the, the grip and it tightened up a bit, so that may be why that's doing that. Uh, it did seem to have a little less recoil with the light, probably because of the weight. Okay, so the light, seven yards. So we got from center to center there, and about two and five eighths, and then over to there, three. Okay, so I put another 60 rounds through it. Uh, 30 with the light and 30 without the light so up to 350 rounds I do think the grips and the light make a difference uh, the grips primarily because you're getting a much better grip on it it's not slipping around in my hand as much I'm still sliding off of here uh, but I think that's just getting a little used to it the light does seem to give it a little less recoil because of the weight on the front uh, but I can't actually uh, say that that's just my feeling on it so I'm pretty happy so far for the uh, minimal amount of upgrades that I put into it